Hi ladies, hey, 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 Glam Squad. To my new subscribers, like and subscribe and join the Glam Squad. And to my returning ladies, thank you for coming back. Please like, share and subscribe to the channel. I appreciate every single one of you. Now let's get into this. Hi ladies, welcome to another video. I'm ready to get into it. So. Under the Copyright Disclaimer 107 of Act of 1976, allowance is made for fair use for purpose such as criticism, comment, news reporting, teaching, scholarship, and research. Please like, share, and subscribe and join the Glam Squad. Girl, let's get into it. Oh, before I get into it, I want to thank you guys for 3,000 plus subscribers. I really, really, really love and appreciate you. And shout out to the Cash Apps. <laughs> And to the super chat, Rochelle W. Pumpkin Baby, you know who you are. Thank you. Because those funds went to my therapy. Um, Cece, love you long time. Toot, I love you long time. Gladys R. and Melita B. Hey, boo. I love you guys and thank you for your donations. Now, baby, <laughs> let's hop into it. I made if Maurice was out here cheating with somebody that I knew about, mm -hmm. let me tell you something. I'm not finna follow shit. Just so you know. Oh. And I'm a Scorpio. Wait, wait, wait. And we're very loyal. Y'all, could Miss Wanda have been a side chick? Or is she a side chick? Because she does have a husband and a boyfriend. And I want to know what elder has that and so proud to say it. This lady's been running her mouth from the get-go. This is when Destiny was kind of okay, cool with Mel. But uh, also, she didn't like being a side chick. <laughs> Here we go, 2023, 2024. Destiny, you always been a side chick for 15 years, even though you was taking up a melody. Mm -hmm. So I'm just trying to say, is um, Tisha Mama a side chick? Why would you go say Ari is nice looking? You want to talk about, oh, um, she should be friends. Melody should be friends with Tisha. So you can say whatever you want to say because it's your daughter's friendship with Mel. Nah. And then she go talk about Destiny have low self-esteem. I think Destiny got big D energy, has always had that. But I don't think she got low self-esteem. But baby, let me play this clip and I'm going to drive it home. For the last past six years, I'm not going to even say five. So yes, that make them sister wives, you know. They all in this together. So, hey, Melon, like I said, put on your grown women panties, baby. And y'all just all be sisters together. Let me just throw that out there. Marceau could not wait for Mel to walk out of that argument with Wanda so he could do this. You know, he loved the way she smelled. He almost want to lick her. But anyway, yeah, let me drive this home for y'all. All right. So being an elder or your age does not make you wise in giving any type of relationship advice. OK, at all. OK, Tisha, your mama has a husband. She has your daddy and she has a boyfriend. Her pH is off. That's what she need to worry about. Okay. No wonder you in a love lich marriage and marriage and all you care about the 18 years, the tenor of the marriage. You don't care that you're being disrespected. You don't care about what's going on. No wonder she's never, she's never in, in her own damn business. She always in somebody else's business. And Wanda, since you like Ariane so much, could she be your daughter? Huh? Y'all look like y'all have the same type of tendencies. First of all, since you petitioning for uh Ariane to be on the show, mm -hmm, I hope you know if Ariane is on the, on the show, she exposes Marceau, okay? The wide back linebackers' names that he has been with, the Airbnbs that they've been in from the streets of Alabama to the streets of ATL, okay? She was on all them trips being flewed out, okay, to be with your son-in-law. So Ariane being on the show does what? OK, for and second of all, Tisha been throwing rocks and hiding her hands since season one, throwing stones, as a matter of fact, and having her mama as her mouthpiece. Y'all, this ain't nothing new. OK, that's why everybody commenting now on this on the season, because it's getting hot on social media. Like, shut your mouth and go back and watch the season from season one. OK, before you come on the Internet and have something to say. Do you understand? Talking about matching cars, okay? Tisha brought that up, okay? Kimmy um, talking about Ari's feelings. Kimmy, uh, Savannah Martell's a good man. Talking about um, Mar asking Martell about how Ariane Curry doing. Why don't you go to her house and sit down and talk to her since you want to be her friends and you, 
you know, you care about her feelings, Kimmy. Savannah Martell's a good man. Uh-huh. Okay. You don't want nobody to say you're a side chick, but you but you definitely want Kiwa, Kaiwa, whatever her name is to be on the show. Because, baby, she would have exposed you. I want to understand why all y'all want to give people advice about Martell and Melly, Melon, like you said. Because Melon about to suit a black skin off your ass. Okay? Anyway, Tisha Mama has been in people business for the longest, okay? And as an elder, she is disrespectful. Her mouth is dirty. She is a ghetto hood country booger, chewing tobacco old lady, okay? So y'all gotta be careful when elders try to give y'all relationship advice. Cause they used to getting butt side aside their head, pH balance being off, granddaddy having two, three kids. Ain't nobody doing that in these days, okay? Also, why is Wanda in everybody's business? Y'all, this has been the messiest mother other than like her and Candy Bird's mom are like runner ups. OK, always in a child business, always want to make a decision on who they date, who they can't date, um, spend the, how much they ma'am. Are you trying to live your daughter's life? Because why would Mel go live talking about a motherless daughters but you can't even say the word you asking about a muttless mother so to me the definition of a muttless mother um in wanda's definition is one of them dogs y'all see on the street the stray dogs every few months they get um pregnant and have a, a litter of puppies and they don't mother them okay um the puppies just be running in the streets and people just picking them up that's a muttless mother boy a hit dog will hollering because since that day you've been crying you've been hollering you even got your ass a lawsuit that's gonna be coming your way now i know male attorney gonna handle it and tell her the right way maybe she'll get a cease and desist whatever it is whatever Whatever it is to shut her muttless mouth up, that's what it needs. Because a hit dog will holler. You feel that you feel inferior and your daughter is inferior to Melody. You're inferior inferior to Miss Van and your daughter feels inferior to Melody. That ain't her fault. Get her some counseling, some enunciation, pronunciation, speech and language courses. Because ma'am, you failed. You felt the school system of Alabama failed y'all really bad. And if Tisha got degrees... Damn it, she don't look like she even went to middle school. Do better. Anyway, y'all, like, share, and subscribe. And I got two questions for y'all. Do y'all have an elderly person that ever gave y'all bad advice? Because, baby. And another question I have. Um, should Arion be on the show? Because, baby, y'all don't get slapped. <laughs> y'all know the answer is no. I'm just trying to be funny. Like, share, subscribe. Bye, ladies. Thank you, ladies, for watching another video. Please like and subscribe, and remember to check out my shop. Bye, ladies.